Hi, in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to see old messages on the Skype application. So, first of all, of course, all you need to do, just go and open the Skype application if you have it already on your PC. Of course, if you don't, all you need to do, just go and open whatever browser you are currently using. Once it's opened, you'll need to go and type at the URL section, download Skype application, hit the enter button, go to the first link and start downloading the application. Of course, this will be pretty easy or pretty simple because you must have been already downloaded something in your PC before. So you will follow the same steps or the same instructions to do that. Once you're done or once it's downloaded, you'll need to install it and open it up. And when it's open, they will ask you to log in into your account if you have one. Go and log in into it, but if you don't, you'll need to go and create one. Once you did one of those two options, you'll find yourself here with this homepage or with this main screen. And as I said at the beginning of the video, you would like to see some old messages on the Skype application. So once you are uh, at this home screen, or this is not the home screen, of course, this is just a group. But once you are at the Skype application, you would like to select the conversation you want. So, of course, here on the chat, you can just go here and choose whatever, like, chat you want to use. And, of course, once you are at the chat, you can just scroll up to retrieve pre previous messages. Of course, if you can't see them even anymore, like, or you can just, or you don't want to scroll up all the way up, you can just go here and use the search button and look for the message that you want. Of course, you must have been, like, remembering a word on it. So let's see an example. I'll just write this test message, which is already have. And as you can see, once I hit the enter button, the test or any sentence uh, contain this test will actually change its color and it will take me right into it. I don't need to write the whole word. I need just to write maybe two or three words on the word and uh, normally it will appear for me. So, this will be actually for this tutorial. I hope you like it. Thank you guys for watching and goodbye. Goodbye. Sorry.